Hey everybody, this is Jen from Cookies, Cupcakes, and Cardio.com, and I have a special guest here with me today. I love it when she calls me special. Oh, yeah, yeah. Is there are all kinds doesn't, of special. doesn't happen that often. <laughs> this is my very good friend, Stephanie Moore, and she is an international boudoir photographer. If you don't know what boudoir is, you're going to have to Google it. Not at work. No, not at work. Don't do it at work. <laughs> Or if you're under 13, don't do that. <laughs> so you might be wondering what in the world are we doing? I'm starting a new series. I've seen a ton of people on YouTube doing challenges and my idea for this one is stuff my dad eats. Cause I don't know about you, but my dad tends to eat odd things. So I thought I've never tried his food. So what a perfect time. And Stephanie being my uh, adventurous? Let's go with adventurous because okay. that's sort I was gonna of, say oddest. Sort of positive. Let's put a spin. You spin it, right? You spin it so it's good. Totally. Adventurous. adventurous. Adventurous friend. So I knew she'd be game for it, and I knew she'd have something really good for me too. Mm -hmm. So I'm. We're gonna feed each other. No, we're not. That'd be gross. That's kind of like, weird. I don't know like, if I'm getting paid enough for this. <laughs> like the wedding. You're getting okay. paid. Oh. No. Wait, okay. <laughs> So, we are going to eat what my dad eats first, and then we're going to eat what Steph's dad eats afterwards. That's because you're a chicken, right? Yeah, because yeah. I know what's coming first. I don't know what she's going to feed me. She doesn't know what I'm going to feed her either. Got her water. Got the sink to puke in. Got Hopefully it doesn't ale. happen. Yes, Grab ginger all. ale. All those things. So, I'm going to go grab mine, and let's see what I got. Okay. <laughs> Are you ready? Probably not, but I'm. It's fine. Okay. We're, we'll just go with it. Stuff my dad eats. Pickled pig's feet, and pork hocks. Wow. Have you had it before? No, but we also raised pigs, so I kind of know where those things come from. Great. So you're super excited. Super. Stoked. And you can tell us what a pork hock is. A pork hock. I had to research it. You can't say that fast. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> pork hock. Oh. Oh, duh. it's like all congealed and stuff. That's my favorite when it's oh. like. It's oh, like you're touching it. It's like a bowl full of jelly. It's like Santa. Oh, smell that. Mm, waft. <laughs> you only waft. <laughs> You don't put your nose up to it. I learned that in biology. You don't put your oh, nose up to it. You just, true. Good you point. Oh my goodness. Smells. How does my father eat this? And this is no joke. Every Christmas he eats this. This is his delicacy at Christmas time. Your dad, I'm glad I have never smelt this before. Your dad loves the hawk. Okay. <laughs> we need... Oh, it's like crumbling like tuna. Mm. Look at that. It's like gelatinous like need to put tuna. some like mayonnaise on it. It won't come out. <laughs> That, that is awesome. I can't. Oh, that's a large piece of hawk. Do you nope. know what the worst part of this is? The worst part of this is that we've been like marathon watching Walking Dead. And it's sort of fleshy. Yeah. It's kind of, it's a little. It's, it's a little, it's a little smelly. It smells a lot like a pickle. Okay. Don't, we we're supposed to count to three. Mmm. It's sort of like mustard. I was thinking like when you accidentally snort salt and vinegar chips. Oh yes. There's a Don't do that by the way. That's there's not, an excess of vinegar. Well. Oh, that is gross. Mmm. You're enjoying this? Good choice, Dad. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Are you ready? For the Tootsies? I think there's like stuck in my teeth. This is gonna like fling out of here like. Oh. <laughs> here you go. Ooh, give Friend. me some of that gelatin. Yes. Um, that's Are bone. You? Yeah, it is. It's a foot. It's a metatarsal. <sighs> so do we eat the bone? I wouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> well, I wouldn't eat a big foot normally anyways. Yeah. No. Do you want to share my foot? This is, this is, I'm so used to putting my feet in my, like, put, you say, like, oh, you really put your foot in your mouth? But I'm not Literally. used to doing, like, a diff somebody else's foot in my mouth. Something. Unless this is, like, oh, there's another piglet or babe. Pro, well. <laughs> that and just, gross things. This is all bones. Well, I, here, have a piece of mine. I'll share with you. 
You're hesitating. I thought you were going to feed me. <laughs> it's supposed to be romantic. <laughs> Cheers! <laughs> Not any better. I think that's almost worse. <laughs> it's worse. It's definitely worse. That is way worse. I think you just swallow it. Oh, God. I think you just, you just like... You just, do it like a, you just do it like a shot where you go, oh, oh my god. <laughs> oh, I swallowed it. <laughs> that is disgusting. Mm. Oh. It's like the worst thing That's I've the ever put thing in my I've mouth. Ever eaten. And I've put a lot of really gross things in my mouth. <laughs> well, this series is off to a great beginning. I don't think I've eaten anything grosser than that. No, so. this makes me want to be one of those religions that don't eat cloven-footed animals. No. Okay, well, oh. I can't wait to see what Steph brought me. Okay, Steph has set up her dad, what her dad eats for me. I can smell already. It smells like fishy, smoky-ishy. Am I on the right track? You're like a bloodhound. So, I... It's not crawling, I'm knowing, happy. Knowing of your delicate nature, <laughs> I, I was a little bit easy on you because like I've watched my dad eat things like woodworms and grasshoppers and <sighs> a fresh steaming deer heart. So I kind of thought probably it's probably better to... It doesn't just, smell like I'll just any like of those. ease you in. And I don't hear I'll any ease noise. You into it. No, it's not moving. So... I have actually three things because there are so many things that my daddy that's really weird. Um, so we have this is a olive stuck stuffed with jalapenos. Okay. Thrills. Oh, I hate those. And a smoked oysters on crackers. It smells like Christmas again. Does he eat this at Christmas too? He eats it kind of like all, all the, time. the time, like. Well, whenever my mom will buy this, you did go easy. Stuff for I did go easy because I didn't want you to. <laughs> I brought a guest on. <laughs> she came willingly. I fed her big pig's feet, I know. and she's in the film. And I have um, seen feed me bubble gum. <laughs> yeah, well, it, but it's so gross though. It's it, just, it's just yes, it is. I hate it. So yeah, so you can start with the olive, and okay. we'll be like all classy. I'm not a big fan stuff. of olives to begin with. I'm not a fan of jalapenos, so. Okay, you give me your jalapeno and I'll give you my no, olive. You just put the whole thing in. I wish eat it. Pickled. Mm. Definitely more tasty than a pig foot. Definitely more. It's mm -hmm. a little bit hot. Actually, it's quite a bit hot. It's getting hotter. <laughs> it is. <laughs> yeah. The cracker, that will cool it. Well, yeah, and I thought it was Ooh. classier to eat it on a cracker because... I'm all about the class. <laughs> oh wait, what, what is, is it this? again? Oyster? Yeah. Okay. Mm -mm. <laughs> I don't remember the last time that I had one of these. I just probably was a kid and probably have never, well, I know, I've never, ever, ever, ever wanted a piece again. This is oh. one that tastes like soap, right? No, it's one that tastes like grapes. Oh, great. It's great. Here we go. It's great. Gum. Oh. Yeah. Still tastes like soap. <laughs> mm. This is, I think, the worst part. What, keeping it in your mouth? Mm, keep chewing. Mm. Willingly keeping chewing. I think the longer you chew, though, the less... Maybe it's because I used to get my mouth washed out with soap as a kid. <laughs> I don't know why. The more you chew it, the less revolting it is. A little bit. But it's, it's like so mixed sweet. in with the oyster, the jalapeno, and, and the, the remnants feet. of the pig's feet. Mm -hmm. It'll clear out your gum pockets, though, for something new. It'll clear out something, that's for sure. <laughs> okay, um, I'm going to take a little break, and then we're going to come back to finish this off. So I think Steph went a little bit easy on me, knowing that she comes from the boonies, we might say. It's like a non-traditional background, is how you say it, <laughs> without being offensive. <laughs> Have a non-traditional upbringing. I apologize. She had no power. Builds no character. water. It builds character, and maybe too. No much, school. So. No school. Yeah, I know. Because <laughs> that's why I'm such a hermit. And now. she still turned out so perfect. Oh. So 
If you want to see Steph come back and us do some more challenges together, make sure you leave a note in the description box, in the comment box below. Um, and if you think that you have something that your dad eats, that's disgusting, mm -hmm. leave that below too, because the next time she comes on, we might pick yours and we'll feature you in the video. And hopefully it's not as gross as those pig's feet. No, I think that was like, that was sort of, it set the bar pretty high, actually, with the pig's feet. For, you started out with a bang. What's up? <laughs> with a bang. With a bang. Oh. So yeah. as we said before, Steph is an international boudoir photographer. You can find her at stephaniemoorephoto.com. Yes. Com. Make sure you check her out. She's done some great pictures of many, many people, and they're absolutely beautiful. And she makes you feel beautiful, which is the biggest thing I think about you. Oh, thanks. So thanks for watching everybody. Remember to subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for more Stuff My Dad Eats and some more challenges.